Hey guys, it's Jesse from the Pathways Wellness Team. Uh, today we're going to talk a little bit about fish consumption. For those that don't know, I grew up working on a salmon fishing boat and fishing is my uh, connection to the world and my favorite pastime. Uh, so I, I think a lot of people know that fish is great for our health and that is due to omega-3 fatty acids. Now this is particularly true for things like salmon, trout, some types of tuna, um, anchovies, sardines, some of the less popular ones. But those those types of fish yield a high amount of omega-3 fatty acids, tend to be a little bit leaner and are very good for our health. So omega-3 fatty acids is beneficial for our heart as well as our brain and then it overall just reduces inflammation throughout our body. What I wanna talk about more specifically is limitations to the amount of fish that we're supposed to be eating. And this is more relevant to fish that are local in our areas, things like walleye, panfish, pike, perch, all of those fish that you know we, we, we can catch locally or we know people that can catch locally. Now these fish tend to live a little bit longer in these waters, so they tend to accumulate more mercury in their body something like a walleye where it's 15 inches is considered a keeper that fish is already six years old when it gets to 20 inches that fish is 11 years old and so it really does build up those toxic chemicals which relates to the limitations that we need to be cautious of now one website you can look at is the michigan department of health and human services eat fish safe guide and that's gonna show you uh, the recommended amount of fish per your body weight for each county throughout Michigan. And that's gonna include all four counties that Passway serves. And it's gonna be different from lake to lake, but for the most part, uh, you know, the UP is fairly low as far as the amount of fish we should be eating. So be mindful of the amount of fish fries that you go out to once we get back to uh, a normal world and be mindful of how much fish you're eating throughout the summer and winter months because there truly is a cautious level that we need to be mindful of. If you have any questions about this, certainly reach out to me. I'm obviously very passionate about it or anyone on the wellness team and make sure you stop by for our wellness breaks on Thursday morning and Thursday afternoon to talk about healthy topics. Take care.